Hello everyone, welcome back to my channel. Today we're gonna do this festival inspired makeup. Uh, we're gonna go in first with the Milani um, priming spray and I'm going to spray her whole face with this. Uh, she loved it. She's hilarious. Um, then what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna take this primer by Maybelline and I'm going to put this all over the face with my fingers uh, and what this is going to do is this is going to minimize the, the pores uh, and make the face a little bit more smooth um, and it's also going to let the foundation stay on the whole day uh, without moving. Next, the foundation I'm going to use is by Milani and I believe this is in shade uh, 02 and I'm going to distribute this throughout the whole face and the neck with a buffing brush by e.l.f. Uh, but then again, but then I'm going to switch into a beauty blender or a beauty sponge by Real Techniques to press this into the skin and give me a really flawless complexion. For the concealer and for the highlight, I'm going to use the Fit Me Concealer um, in the shade, in the shade Fair Claire, I believe it's the lightest shade. Um, to kind of give her give me a really beautiful highlight and I'm going to go ahead and blend that out with a uh, beauty sponge by Real Techniques again all the products that I'm using in this video will be linked uh, will be in the description box on the bottom of the video Next, I'm going to use the Airspun Translucent uh, Setting Powder with the uh, sponge under the eyes and everywhere where I put the concealer to really set it and lock it in place and, does it, and so that it doesn't move throughout the day. Uh, now for the rest of the face, I'm going to use the Revlon uh, Setting Powder number 20 uh, to set the rest of our foundation. Now to bronzer up, because this is a festival makeup, I'm gonna use Kiss Me Sun, oh, Give Me Sun, by MAC. Um, and this is going to give me a bronze, uh, beautiful sun kiss uh, look. And some dimension in the face. Now to um, make the contour a little bit more sharper, I'm going to use this shade and light, um, Palette, contour palette by Kat Von D, the middle shade right there, and I'm going to just use this in the same places where I put the bronzer, but this is going to be a little bit more sharp. And whatever is less in the brush, I'm going to use on the side of the nose to snatch the nose. Now for the um, for the blush, I thought I used this beautiful peachy blush on the apples of the cheeks, and using the Anastasia Beverly Hills um, highlighting palette, I'm going to use that shade right there, and I'm going to put that on the uh, highest points of the cheekbones to really give her a beautiful glow Now after I put this highlights, I am gonna go in with uh, Laura Geller uh, Gilded Honey highlights, but I'm going to sp spray with her face with this uh, Setting spray and before it dries I'm going to place the highlight right on top of her cheekbones to give her a blinding glow This is beautiful now with the white eyeliner, I'm going to use this as the base for the eyeshadow and why I'm using this is because I want the blue to really stand out um, and I'm going to blend it out with my finger and with the Inglot blue eyeshadow, I don't know the name but I'll link it below, I'm going to use that blue with a fluffy, fluffy brush and place that on the crease and I'm going to go ahead and blend it out with a blending brush and I'm going to just repeat the steps until I see what I like. With this other shimmery blue I'm going to use that with a concealer brush, a synthetic brush and I'm going to just place that all over the lid uh, for a really beautiful shiny blue. Now I'm going to grab a um, a slightly darker blue from the electric palette palette by uh, Urban Decay and I'm going to put that blue on the outer corners of the eye just to give it a little bit of dimension. 
grabbing that white right there, I'm going to place that right under the eyebrows for a really intense highlight. And I'm gonna grab this glitter liner by NYX in silver, and I'm gonna place that right under the um, brow bone, right under the eyebrow, just a thin line uh, to make it pop. I'm gonna grab that white again and I'm gonna place that in the inner corner of the eyes to uh, really open up her eyes. And then I'm gonna grab the uh, silver from the electric palette and put that on top of it as well. So what I'm gonna do now is I'm gonna grab these little rhinestones that I got from Joann's. Uh, it's a, a fabric store and I'm going to place that on the inner corner with um, lash glue. I'm also going to put that on the bottom of the, in the middle of the bottom of the lashes and the corner, but right now I'm going to use that same eyeliner, that white eyeliner, and put that in the waterline to open up her eyes even more. And then I'm going to use the same shades that I use on the top, I'm going to use them on the bottom. Difference. and she finished up her wine so the outer corner um, rhinestone I'm gonna place it a little bit high but later on I moved it to right under the lashes so you can see it yes you better work Salita What I'm gonna use is a sh nude um, lipstick, liquid lipstick by ColourPop, and the name CHI, Chai, Chi Chai, something like that. I'm going to uh, put that all over her lips, and I'm gonna grab Candy Yum Yum Lip Gloss by MAC, and I'm gonna put that all over the lips, and this is going to make um, the lip color a little bit more peachy and nude and that's really what I, wa what I wanted for this look and after that uh, the look is complete I'm going to set everything again with the setting uh, spray and the look is done now later on I do decide to put a little bit more highlights but that's just uh, my preference thank you everyone so much again for watching uh, my tutorial please subscribe to my channel and give me a big thumbs up I really really appreciate it um, I love you so much, and I will see you in the next one. Bye-bye. Yo les digo de, 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 de,